Shebanga throws Welshman, BT in the dustbin. Self-imposed and controversial Citizens Coalition for Change CCC Secretary General Senjizo Chibangu has fired the entire party leadership, saying their tenure of office expired. Those dismissed include Welshman Cube and Tendai Bite, who hijacked the party from Nelson Chimisa early this year. The two used Chibangu to frustrate Chimisa. Through his lawyers, Shebengo announced over the weekend that the terms of all officials elected at the party's Congress in Gweru in May 2019 have now expired. He asserted that all former MDC officials, including Welshman Cube, who served as interim president, can no longer act on behalf of the CCC. It is misleading to suggest that anyone has been fired. The legal opinion expressly deals with interpretation of the party constitution. Some office bearers' offices have expired by operation of law party constitution and there is need for the party to operate within the confines of law and constitution. Anyone with a different opinion slash interpretation is welcome to place it on record and it shall be interrogated. Shebangu said he will soon be appointing a steering committee that will be in charge of party issues until holding of the Congress. He said, the interim secretary general shall institute the working steering committee which shall ensure that the party is re-established at grassroots level upwards leading to a congress. A virtually unknown politician before the August 23, 2023, harmonized elections, Shebengo rose to prominence after he boldly issued multiple recalls of CCC MPs and councillors, claiming they had ceased to be party members. His actions receive support from key figures, including the Speaker of the National Assembly, the Senate President, and the Minister of Local Government and Public Works, as well as the courts, effectively disrupting the CCC and leading to party leader Nelson Chamisa's resignation, which he attributed to infiltration by adversaries. Now a senator. Shebanga enjoys increased wealth, including a car, a house, an elevated status, allowing him to mingle with Zimbabwe's political elite. He is also poised to receive 1.6 million US dollars, which represents CCC's share of state funds under the Political Parties Finance Act. Please like, comment, share and follow this channel for more information or updates on news and entertainment.